hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel at chichi's secrets karibu karibu sana today i'm going to be showing you two methods of making yummy crunchy fish finger like you see on your screen and trust me when you make it like this your kids will absolutely absolutely love it <music> So the ingredients we're going to be needing are fish finger, breadcrumbs, flour, and two eggs. Feel free to use less than two eggs. So first I'm going to go in by cutting the fish fingers to bite sizes. You can make them longer or shorter depending on the size you want but this size is really nice. All the ingredients i'm using in this video you can easily get them around you the breadcrumbs i made myself from the stale bread in my kitchen if you haven't seen the video on how to make breadcrumbs then click, click the link above to watch that video i bought this fish fillet for about 300 kenya shillings and every other ingredient are the things i have in my house so i'm going to be adding some salt to the breadcrumbs I'm also going to be marinating the fish and adding just a little bit of salt in the eggs as well. <laughs> to marinate the fish, I'll be adding a bit of black pepper, a little bit of salt, some parsley, some rosemary, and a little bit of bouillon cubes. Feel free to tweak the ingredients to your taste or how you want it. Now I'm going to be mixing all together. I'll also be adding a cup full of olive oil and then I'll leave to marinate for about 15 minutes. So when that time is up, now it's time to mix everything together. So I'm adding a bit of black pepper to the flour as well. Now I'm first going to dip the fish fillet into the flour and then dip into the eggs and finally to the breadcrumbs. And finally coating with breadcrumbs. When this is all done, you now it's time to dip oil fry. So when our fish finger turns a bit golden brown, we'll place on a paper towel so that the oil gets sucked out and it's ready. So this is the result and this is the first type of fish finger. Now let's do the other one. So to the breadcrumbs I'll be adding paprika, mixing up together. Adding a little bit of black pepper just because I like a little tang to my fish finger. 
and to the eggs i'll be adding some fresh pepper this is actually hot spicy hot fresh pepper i'll also be adding some paprika to the flour and some paprika to the chicken now i'm going to be repeating the same process i did in the other one just putting it in the coating it with the flour coating it with eggs and finally breadcrumbs but i'm luxuriously coating it with breadcrumbs because i like mine crunchy really crunchy so we're going to fry as usual and this is the result as well so let's compare both styles of making fish finger this is the spicy fish finger it has spice in it and it is delicious tasty but if you're somebody who cannot tolerate spice then don't try this method you can use the first method i did you can also offer the first method to kids and well that's nice so when you're all done you can just package everything in this is supposed to last about a week but i'm sure it will finish within the next three days it's so nice and crunchy so don't forget to subscribe to my channel and i'll see you guys in my next video